Good afternoon. I'm Don Jones. I'm a volunteer here at Bachauer Gardens. Uh, we're on top of the tower, uh, which is on top of Iron Mountain, 298 feet above sea level. So now we're in the founder's room on level one of the tower. This is the only room that's really finished beautifully in the tower. The rest of the tower is, is more utilitarian with steel beams and red brick. This is a keyboard where we play the carillon. It's called a clavier, French literally for keyboard. Uh, each bell has a lever that goes through a cable up through to the bell and rings the clapper. The tower was built and finished in 1929 by Edward Bach. He was the editor of the Ladies Home Journal. The bell chamber is about 60 feet high and 40 feet wide. And as you can see, uh, the bells are just above me. The largest bells are on the lower level. And as, as we go up, the bells get smaller. Notice the columns. They could have been simple round columns and that would have been easy. It's laid out very similar to a piano. There's white keys down here and here's threes and twos like the black keys on a piano. We're on the highest point of land and plus we're 200 feet up so you can almost see coast to coast if it wasn't for the curvature of the earth. We have a beautiful view looking north at the horizon. You can just barely see a white building. That's the heart of Florida hospital. A little off to the right of that, you can see the dome at Epcot and the Marriott Hotel and some of the Disney World structures. The columns are sculpted, all the corners are different shaped corners. The floor I'm standing on is called the Tree of Life. You can see the tree branches coming out. In the tree, you'll see different animals and birds, and out around the edge are the oceans. And there's fish and lobsters and, and uh, different animals in the oceans. Lots of orange groves out to the east. Uh, a little bit southeast is a large white structure. That's a citrus concentrate plant. The largest bell is over to the right. It's called the Burdon Bell. Uh, it has a clapper that weighs 400 pounds, so it takes quite an effort to ring that bell. That's the bell that weighs 22,400 pounds or 12 tons. The main difference in a carillon, though, to a piano is a piano, it takes the same effort to ring the the, uh, play the highest note and the lowest note, but on a carillon, as you go down the scale, the bells get larger and larger, and it's harder to ring the bells. The, the bigger bells, you, you really have to push hard. Moving around a little bit to the northwest, you see a few structures in the distance. That's the city of Winter Haven. The white structure a little closer is the Legoland Hotel. These beautiful gardens and the tower were built by Edward Bach as a gift to the American people. He came here as a poor immigrant and became a very wealthy man as editor of the Ladies Home Journal and really wanted to give something back to the American people. And so he built these gardens and this tower for people to come and visit. It's just quite an experience being up here. It pretty much takes everybody's breath away. I enjoy uh, telling people about it when they come, especially I ask the question, do you know who Eberbach was? And very few people do, so I really enjoy telling people about Eberbach.